I worked for years with uh, Peter Grace. Peter Grace, until his retirement, was the longest sitting CEO of any Fortune 100 company in America. He held that position for approximately 47 years. Peter Grace dealt in the spreadsheet concept of analyzing all of his sub-businesses. I'll never forget, he, he was in a meeting one time, and I had the pleasure to be in that meeting, and he was talking to two division presidents about their competitors. And he said, if you have two products of equal values to the consumers, and you have two executive teams of equal knowledge and experience, the one that has the best information in the most timely manner will always win over the other. And what Brenda's company offers you is that information. Big press in and out through your mouth, nice and slow for me, okay? Six-year-old Natalie Seitz has asthma. Good job, let it out. Her parents work, but cannot afford health insurance, and they worry whenever Jessica has an asthma attack. Um, excellent. This is very scary. We never, you know, but. You just take it day by day and pray. That's all you can do is hope that it works itself out. After spending thousands on hospital visits, the sites got medical treatments they could afford from the Informed Clinic. We feel we're a solution um, to those 43 million Americans that have no health insurance. The clinics are designed like membership discount retail stores like Costco or Sam's Club. The sites pay an annual fee and get basic medical services at discount prices. We um, do it in a retail health setting, which um, allows us to offer our prices 50% below market rates compared to our traditional current health care system as it is. How do you think we're doing with the, the clinics are run by nurse practitioners, not doctors. This is the thing that worries the American Medical Association. The physician organization says for very simple medicine, these clinics could help, but... On the other hand, if the patient goes there expecting to receive care for something that's far more acute and or far more lingering, we are, we'll have concern. For the uninsured who use the clinic, it comes down to some health care being better than no health care at all. There is really no option. You know, I, I, there's no way I could afford uh, to try to get insurance. Informed plans a chain of clinics nationwide inside Shopco stores with potentially easy access to customers like the Sites who have no health insurance. Big breath. And it's the clinic visits the sites' is credit with getting Jessica's asthma under control and helping them steer clear of expensive emergency room visits. Steve Brown, Fox News.